Hi, I'm Shannon Quigley. I am a District Technology Coordinator. My name is Kenneth Kamek. I am Supervisor of Structural Wiring and AV. Hi, my name is Shirley Strope. I work in technology as a project leader. I'm uh, Sam Wilmer and my job title is the Manager of Research and Evaluation. My name is Diana Fulton and I am the Supervisor of Network Support Services here at FWCS. Well, my name is Rick Herber and I am a District Technology Coordinator and my main primary focus is STEM and STEAM and the support of that within our schools. Uh, Randy Wirt, Supervisor of Communications and Advanced Systems. I am a District Technology Coordinator, so I am one of eight in this position and I work primarily with elementary schools, so we all cover a different group of schools and our job is to go out and meet with the principal, the coach, the teachers, and talk about ways that they can um, integrate technology in meaningful ways into their curriculum, into the ways that they're working with students. What we do is manage uh, all audio video devices as well as network um, drops. Um, we manage and hang uh, monitors, TVs, um, touch screens throughout the district. Basically anything that has to do with low voltage, we take care of. I have been in the department 25 years and over the years I started out work with student management and I also started out with supporting the HR payroll department. Well, me and my team, which is about four to five, depending upon uh, who's decided to stay, leave, or get uh, promoted, I work primarily with the infrastructure on the network, uh, the, the, the stuff that makes the bits go back and forth. If you need to get to the internet, it's going to go on something we're responsible for. I am the supervisor of 31 uh, technicians, four that are help desk technicians, and then 28 um, network technicians that are basically out in the field. Uh, they're the face of the technology department. Uh, they're the fixed repair men and women. Within the technology department, I do all things related to data. This includes uh, creating different reports, so our teacher, teacher data briefcase, which provides a one-stop shop for teacher data to different ad hoc reports, so I get a request for attendance during a specific school year. The best part about my job is that I get to work with so many different groups of teachers and students and getting to see um, things that I'm passionate about, teachers are passionate about, students are passionate about, come together and create more meaningful learning experiences for students. Just working with the people, to be honest with you. I've commented several times that this group is like no other that when we uh, do things throughout the district, we partner very well, and it's a fun environment to work on. It's great just to see what the end effect is in terms of what we do for the district and how we provide them support on a daily basis. Seeing the kids light up when they get the concept. Uh, I was out helping a uh, elementary school today and I was teaching them the concepts of 3D printing and utilizing the software needed to model a 3D and as the kids were going through it they were doing different lessons and different um, um, parts of it they were highly engaged and they were very focused and they were loving it they actually really enjoyed it it is never the same day twice um, I can come in with a vision and a hope and a goal and it can be totally shot down um, but it's all about my kids, all the kids and supporting those students. Supporting our building so they can make better decisions with their data, improve their student achievement. Really when I can make our teachers, school staff, I can make their lives easier. As district technology coordinators, our main goal is to really help with best practices in instructional technology. So we work really closely with the curriculum and professional learning departments to make sure that the goals that we're setting for teachers and students align with the district's vision for how we can achieve those goals um, in the classroom. So I find that our role as coordinators is really essential, especially since technology is ever present and can really be a catalyst for student learning. Um, we, but we want to make sure we're doing that all within the same format with the same goals in mind. So I feel like our role as coordinators really helps support the district's um, visions around literacy, numeracy, and SEL and really pushing those forward into the classroom through technology. We have a team of uh, five people, including myself, uh, that work throughout the district on a daily basis. And 
Because the district is so dependent on technology these days, uh, they can't afford not to have their systems, functions, TVs, monitors, projectors working. So we uh, provide support uh, for that uh, area of, the, of technology and make sure that all those things are functional and working. Our main focus with STEM and STEAM is to help students grow with critical thinking skills and STEM and STEAM and those initiatives and the robots and the coding, that all brings computational critical thinking skills to the table, teaches creativity. I always tell people that what our job is, is to be invisible. We don't want a student or a teacher to worry about the network. We want it to fundamentally work every day when they show up and pop the lid open on their, their laptop or, or swipe up on their iPad to, to get to a site they need to get to or to perform some activity. That needs to just happen. So the job of my team is to make sure that students have the devices that they need um, to integrate technology and utilize it at the start of school. So you're talking about 30,000 devices that we have to prep, clean, get ready, and disperse uh, for, for, in time for first day of school. In addition to, we have staff devices that we also have to prepare and we have to make sure technology is working inside of each one of those classrooms. I want to provide teachers with data um, that then can be turned into information so they can improve student achievement. Well, I started in the district as an elementary school teacher and I love teaching and working with students and one of the best parts of my job as a teacher were finding ways to connect with students and increase engagement and getting that real love of learning. I'm here because I love working with people. I love seeing the end result with students, uh, seeing them go from uh, empty, sort of, when they first start here at Fort Wayne Community Schools and see them go out the door as they graduate uh, full of knowledge, full of experience, ready to go out and conquer the world. Extremely rewarding when you can go out to a classroom or help support an agenda or an initiative or a project for our students and when they get it and a smile comes across their face and the light bulb lights up over their head, that's just something that you can't get anywhere else. When I first started at FWCS, I started at a school. I was a secretary. I loved the kids. What makes me happy and makes my, I guess my why statement um, is I love what I do. Um, whether it's helping students, whether it's helping families, um, it, it's building our future leaders in our, our community. And I can't do it by myself, but I think it's really cool that I have just a small part playing in that uh, development of our students. One thing that I think makes our department so unique is that we have a true team mentality and we work um, from you know people who are naturally educators to people who are naturally on the technology side have kind of bridged gaps in our knowledge to support each other and really help work towards a vision of technology in the classroom that's going to change instruction or support instruction and change the data for our district in positive ways. We touch so many other departments on what we do on a daily basis. And we really have to come together as a team to accomplish some of the things that we need to do here. We function great as a team. We are not a silo-based um, organization, if you will. We rely on each other to get our jobs done. I think the level of trust that our district has in our department is tremendous. Uh, we've had some really big tasks given to us over the past few years since I've been here, and the entire district has gotten behind us. Um, I think we work super well together. Um, no one has an ego. Everyone's willing to work together, listen to ideas, and that's what makes us great. Um, I went to Wayne High School, and I thought it was important to come back and give back what was poured into me when I was coming through. I had some very good uh, mentors throughout the uh, time that I was at Fort Wayne Community Schools. Cooperation and synergy between the different areas because we've got some pretty wide ranges of what people do on a day-to-day -day basis. 
and and the ability for those of us on you know two ends of a spectrum to be able to communicate whether it's through a, through an intermediary or directly is incredibly beneficial and and i think really really in the long run has helped this department become as strong and i think as successful as it is